While we love her as the feisty publicist and social media guru Lauren Heller on Younger, Molly Bernard is taking on a new role as mom in the new film, Milk Water. But as we see, her role of surrogate isn't always met with support. Take a look. I don't know anything about you or your family history. Did you even go to college? Yes, I went to college. I went to Vassar. I, I double majored in music and Greek and Roman studies. Awesome, useful choice. Um, I got a 2110 on my SATs. I'm allergic to pet dander and kiwis. I'm on 20 milligrams of Celexa for depression and anxiety. And um, both of my parents are dead. And Molly joins us now. Molly, good to see you. How are you? So good to see you. I'm well. How are you? I'm doing good. Listen, we talked about this film last year when it was taking the festival route. Now it's out for the world to see. How excited are you? I am thrilled. This movie means so much to me. It, it was such a labor of love and I... It's, it's so different than other things that I've done and it's, you know, my first experience leading a film and I'm just so thrilled that people will get to see that. And it's such a good story. People are going to love it. It really is. It's a great story. And we go on a journey with her, with your character. And it's, you know, it's kind of conflicting how you feel about her sometimes. Like, sometimes you're rooting for her. Sometimes you want to scream at her and, like, shake her, like, wake up! Don't do that! How do you feel about her? And what kind of resonates with you about this character? Yeah, I mean, those, I, I love the way you phrased it. I feel like, yes, the, the, you do kind of want to shake her because she's so lost. And for me, a lot of my 20s, um, I felt like I was flailing for a lot of it and yeah. seeking, seeking some meaning and some control. And that is exactly what Milo is doing. You know, she chooses to take on the surrogacy as a way to give some meaning to her life. And it is... Um, it's not easy to watch because she's really messy yeah. and it wasn't easy to do it wasn't easy to play because she's so messy but um i loved her and i could relate to her so i, I did my best to um you know at a certain point in the film it, it turns you're like wait i was so mad at her now i love her and i yeah I feel like that's kind of what's so special about this film and and i had to really just drop into that and surrender to that kind of ride that that I was on. You know, the movie touches on so many so many topics, some current issues. I mean, but it also just it talks about motherhood. It talks about uh, being lost in your life. It talks about having children in a gay relationship. It, there's so many different topics that you can relate to in this. Um, when you first read the script, how did you feel about it and what resonated with you? And has that changed because some time has passed? Boy, yeah. Um, when I first read the script, I was I couldn't put it down. I was I was struck by again this complicated nature, of this whirlwind of this character. Now that it's it has it's going to take on this life of its own. I'm I'm so it's a time capsule, and I'm I'm glad that that exists because that was a really special time in my life, and um, the film also exists in a pre-COVID world and there's something naive about it and sweet and tender. You've also been sharing on your social media that you're a parent in training uh, because of your younger co-star, Hilary Duff, and you were at her home birth recently. Let me tell you, I watched my sister give birth before I had kids and it's a trip, right? It is, It. I mean, it. I am permanently changed. I it, know. It, I don't know how, yeah, my view of what it is to be alive. And I, I was, I was, I'm shook, obviously. <laughs> I know. I know. And I still had three babies after watching my sister do that. So, <laughs> so I don't know how that happened. But, but speaking of younger, uh, season seven, the final season is here. It's airing now. Big changes for Lauren this season. She's turning 30. Like, boo hoo. <laughs> but also she's becoming a boss like what are you most proud of uh with lauren over these past seven seasons i am so proud that i had the privilege to play a woman who loves herself unconditionally and celebrates herself and she's queer and i think it takes a lot of bravery to to do that like i'm not there yet i play her but yeah I, you know, I'm an, I'm an actress, I'm queer, but I still struggle with all of 
all of those, all of the little ingredients that, that amount to my recipe of self. Do you think that she influenced you at all to be a little bit more like her? Totally. I hope that for the rest of my life, I, I will always have a little Lauren on my shoulder. Yeah. And I hope she's saying like, yes, do the bold thing here. Do the, yeah. do the thing that's a, a little bit scarier than, than, you, than you would be willing to commit to. Do yeah. it. You'll be okay. Take the leap. Yeah, that's a good thing for all of us to remind ourselves of. Um, all right, well, Milk Water is available for rent and purchase digitally nationwide and, of course, Catch Younger, streaming now on Paramount+. Plus. Molly, always good to see you. Thanks so much for catching up. Likewise. Thank you so much.